Rockridge, Nick Rosita, I'm going to train you how to use your laptop, hook it up to your Promethean board, and actually write on it. Glenn is behind the camera. He is the one taping this whole training session, if you would. For today's training session, you will need the following. Your laptop. Make sure you're logged in. And your bag full of goodies, all right? Take out from your bag of goodies your VGA cable with audio, okay? What we're gonna do is this. We're going to plug this bad boy into the wall and screw it tightly into this plate, your black plate, okay? At the front of the room that does not have your RGB outlets, okay? No video or audio stuff, okay? This is, in most cases, in the back of the room. Don't plug into here. I know you want to, but that's for a later time. Also plug in your audio. Then take the other end and just simply plug it into your laptop. Awesome. So now, what do we need to do? Do we use Our remote control. Some of us are going, absolutely, I mean, that's what I use. No. In fact, this is actually kind of useless to us right now. I know that sounds weird, but it's true. We don't need this right now. In fact, just put it inside your laptop bag. Don't use it, okay? All you need to do is press your select button, okay? Green light goes on, and your Promethean board will begin to light up, okay? You'll see that there's a slow display coming. You'll see that your light is green right there, and eventually it will light up, okay? That's all you need to do to uh, uh, get this working, okay? Just make sure your laptop's plugged into the side. That's it. Do not, even though some of you are going to want to do this, don't press this button. Now, we often hear that green is good, red is bad. In this case, green is bad, red is good. Confused yet? I am, okay? But this is what we need to do. And you'll notice that it's up here. Here's our display. We look great, right? So now you're like, I'm ready. I'm gonna take my gray pen because it looks a lot cooler than the other gray pen. And you're gonna sit there and go, it's not writing. It's not writing because you have not plugged in your USB cord. Now, this goes into the side of your Promethean board, right here. This side goes into your laptop. And you should hear that, da da It'll blank out for a split second. It's looking to install the drivers if it's the first time that you've done this, okay? You'll notice that it is plugged in when you have this little icon, and the active manager says that it has a device found. You're good to go. You can start writing on it. You might want to calibrate though, right? How do you calibrate? You take your pen, hover over your flame of learning, and ignite it. And you don't have to have the 25 test gear like I do. You can just do five. But it is fun, isn't it? There you go. And so now, you're good to write, okay? So, go to all programs. Go to active software and click active inspire and Active Inspire will show up. So if you want to start writing on your board, you may do so, all right? You'll see that your flames come up. You can just close this for now. And there you go. So now you're able to write, okay? Now, how do you know your sound's working? Go to Internet Explorer, and let's have some fun. Let's go to YouTube.
I'm going to bring up my favorite artist, Mr. Dylan. And look at that. We'll go ahead and skip the ad if that's okay with you. And here's Bob. Bob's coming out of the ceiling. Now, some of you are not Dylan fans and you're happy that I'm turning my volume down right here from my plates. Your sound should be coming out of your ceiling, not out of your Promethean board speakers, okay? So if you don't have this ability, you need to contact Glenn or myself immediately, okay? So that's sound. Now, some of you right now are going, well, Grisita, all this is kind of a mute issue for me because I can't even get my display up on my board. That's because you haven't duplicated your display, all right? So what do you do? You very simply press function F1, and you have four options. It should be on duplicate display. Now, if you can't get that up on your laptop, that's not a Promethean board issue, that's a laptop issue. Glenn and I can come by and help you out with that very easily. Just contact us via email, we'll come down and make sure that we get that up on your board, okay? Now, this is just a brief training on how to hook up your laptop to the Promethean board, for now, and how to write using Active Inspire and get your volume out of your ceiling, okay? Again, put your remote away. You don't need it. You don't need it. All you need, VGA cable hooked up to the plate, audio hooked into the plate, audio hooked up to your laptop. USB plugged into the side of the Promethean board, USB plugged into the side of your laptop. That's all you need for today. That's all you need for flight day. Any other issues, Come by the training room in the library, see Glenn or myself. Keep smiling, Rockridge.